Can we tell so, you? what's the first question that you want to like ask? Actually, you know, what? how do you guys like feel about this whole like, experience thing? The first, uh, the first week. Yeah. The first week. Um. Go ahead and your name. Yeah. Uh, at least for me, it was very different. I wasn't expecting to do as much like dancing and singing as, as we've done. I thought it was yeah. mainly acting, but it's always a new experience. So mm. it's gonna be it's gonna be helpful at some point. I know. Well, true. So like, are you adjusting to like this whole new environment when it comes to like the singing? Yeah. At least the singing. Because. I did singing in the previous ones, but it was always in context of the play, rather than like in like musical theatre. There's singing just in in general. Um, so yeah, it's it's different, but it's not completely different. If that makes sense. Okay, well, not too bad in your favour, basically. Yeah. So Maya, how do you like feel about this whole experience? Like, overall? it's been enjoyable meeting new people and everything, and also showing like how different things are working here in comparison to old colleges and whatnot as well as my old experience as well with last year where some people had to show me like Nathaniel and Mackenzie had to show me how it ran here in this college um but it's definitely been interesting going over everything and the harmonies are obviously going over it's fairly simple and similar to how we did last year with that uh, the so would you say, like, as of right now, you feel like you're more confident when it comes to like going through certain songs? Yeah, definitely, definitely more confidence than I did with last year, um, because I'm a bit more comfortable now as well, having a year of experience here. So, definitely more confidence. Yeah. Mm. What about you? Like, how do you necessarily like feel about this? This like whole weekend stuff. In yeah. Day? Well, as I've, I'm really happy with it because I've been wanting to get into year two since I started because <laughs> I know yeah. it's just like it's more natural to me because it's more yeah. plays and it's just I like it more. And I think since being here for three years, being out of everyone here, the one who's been here the longest, it feels already it feels extremely different. Level two and three, sure, they were completely different in terms of like work ethic. But in terms of like what you're doing, it's very similar because mm. it's just musicals and like a lot of dancing, and that's fine. But going into year two, we've like it already. I, I feel like I'm in year. I feel I'm more responsible. I feel like I need yeah. to be a lot more mature, and like I feel like I'm am mature. But like I need to, I need to realize that there's so many new people, and I need to like help them, and I need yeah. to like, I mean, help Jaden as well because he's new, <laughs> <laughs> especially in a year two course like this, where it's like a lot yeah. more. You get your sort your, sort yourself out, sort your shit out, basically. Yeah, you mentioned work effort. Work, work effort. effort. Yes, <laughs> yes, I did. Um, so, what would you say in comparison to the last two years you've been here? What would you change of how you've yeah, done it all? My friend. Oh, dog. Interruption. No, it's all right. Mind your stuff. Oh God! Oh, oh, it's, it's all going. It's all going. It's all going, going bad. Bad. Sorry. Just carry on. Just take it off charge for now. Just take it off charge. I'll just toss it aside. Don't worry. No, give me yours. No, because it's right. It's literally has no storage. Oh, okay. No, I'll just send you my phone or something. That's fine. I mean, you can have audio anyway. So I think you have the audio as well. Yeah, I'll just send you it or something. But you mentioned work effort. To say, just mention question Yeah, you mentioned work effort. Work ethic, Maya. It's okay. Sorry. Work ethic. Okay. 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 Mm -hmm. um, so, what's been? What would you do differently in comparison to your last two years here? In compar um, in comparison to what? Yeah. Now, like, like no, no, yeah. So, what basically? In what consideration what, of what we're doing this year. What, what will I change? The last. To the last year. Years. So, what will I change? What will you change, and how you go about things? I think like, what I'm going to change now since the last from like level two and level three um i'm gonna like do a lot more like re research on like everything i can i'm gonna try and like like but but like not like internet like we said i'm gonna like try and find like, actual like physical copies of self and like my work ethic i want to try and like i want to do more group stuff because when i yeah. what i noticed with my last vlogs i was always so shaky because yeah. i'm always i am just shaking my talk and stutter a lot Mm. It's just a thing I do, but I feel like at least with this, I'm. I just. I just feel comfortable. I know you three. Yeah, it's not like talking yeah. to a camera. You're talking to another person. I'm talking to yeah. another person. Like, even if it's with two people, 
like just if, if I was just to do a vlog with you, yeah, I probably cool. would feel comfortable. There are three people, and I want to like try and do more group um, work, especially like more group vlogs, and like yeah. try and come together. Like obviously, we need to do independent research, and it's all our own it's what we need to think. Yeah. But I want to like vlog wise, I want to like um, working as a group. Yeah, work as a group more. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that's a bit of a problem. Like. Mm. Any, do we have any? Do you have any other questions? Or Jane, do you have any other questions that you want to answer to everyone else here? Well, you, no, are, you didn't actually get to answer the question earlier. Yeah. So, um, so, um, so yeah, how how how's your experience this week been? Well, to be honest, compared to like last year, it's quite a massive gap. Like, given that there's people who have like even more experience than me, it was like quite overwhelming because I was thinking, okay, well maybe I'm not going to be like at the top of my own like league mm -hmm. as well. Mm -hmm. But I surprisingly caught up. Given like my background with like certain things, I'm familiar with, I wouldn't think it would be like helpful. Of course, it's not a professional level. It's like I know enough to sort of go like, okay, that's another. This is something, and then with the help of like my and my family and individually, like that kind of got me to sort of be like, oh, okay, what would this person do, or like what would this person do, or yeah. how would they think about a certain thing, or like a certain harmony, or a certain way to practice this thing. I'll just think exactly like so. It's very personal because at the end of the yeah. day. You're still learning. It's not like okay, mm -hmm. I'm a small ass boy knowing <laughs> everything. It's like yeah. you're, you're learning through like everybody else. Yeah, so you're, you're picking up on everything on what people are doing. You're picking okay, so what what is this person doing right or well that I can implement into my I don't know song yeah, exactly. or like implement into the ensemble yeah. piece or just anything really. That's actually a good point. What would each of you take from what you see other people do? What would you take as inspiration for yourself Ooh, to do? That is a good question. No. You know, here's, here's one, um, actually from Harrison. Get on with it as soon as yeah. it is. Because I am really good at, um, like, I am decent like research and I do, I love doing research. I like figuring out stuff and I like, ooh, what's this? I like, I like that stuff. But my yeah. problem is, is probably procrastination and just not getting on with it. Because I know I can get on with it and I would love to be able just to crack on and yeah. just i think we, i'm saying i think i'm probably speaking for a lot of people all four three of us and all four of us yeah but i just want to be able to get on with it and just like start it and like so at, at least that at least yeah. Yeah. have something and not like wait a few weeks and then just not have something and not so on yeah. i want at least have something to go off on but at yeah, least definitely. thanks to rob he has helped us that, like by showing him showing showing us i mean that thing he did from Macbeth and like yeah. that's a good thing I'm just like I want to be able to just start as soon as I can yeah that's definitely because I was pretty consistent I was pretty consistent with that for the first week last year I was doing vlogs and then I just it just stops because you're getting to a routine or you're rehearsing and you're tired and you just don't want to do do yeah. it and yeah. obviously you I do want to do it but just I guess I just want to be much more consistent with yeah. what I'm doing yeah. really yeah I feel like as if with that alone, I kind of taken a lot of inspiration, like not only from like my past habits, but from other people. Like, there's been times where it's also like, you know, the sort of how do I explain, it? like sheep mentality, where it's like you know people kind of gather around. Like, let's say for example, one gets lazy, then get, like everybody else. Yeah, gets so lazy. yeah, yeah. yeah. So, like you don't want to be that. You want to be. Yeah, that's just paranoia as well. Yeah. and I was just thinking, okay, yeah. well, I don't want to be like this, but also it's like if I kind of distance myself from this whole group situation, I wouldn't know what the hell is going like, on. If you're not involved with what these people's like personal drama is or whatever it is, you'll you'll be fine. It's not like yeah, it's like even with personal drama, I'd rather like just ease it because we're all in the same trouble. As well. Yeah, we're we're yeah. all in the same yeah. course. We all we shouldn't be hating each other. We're we shouldn't. A team. We, we shouldn't should be at each other's together neck. Together as a team. No, it's still a struggle because even at the end of the day, it's like personal problems can also come in and evolve. But as right now, it doesn't seem to be like that problematic because everybody's adjusting. Obviously, it can change any sort of time, but that doesn't yeah. necessarily mean yeah. you can't just go like really blunt and be like, yo, sorry, I don't want to deal with this sort of stuff and just yeah. go. It, because some people can't really necessarily take that sort of thing mm -hmm. as well. So I'm sensing yeah. a lot of like maturity and more like people actually having yeah. fun and actually Which getting is a good thing. Day. Yeah. I, I do have a question. It's actually just for like the future of what we're doing. Yeah, sure. What do you, all of you actually like in terms of actually being an actor and not like doing independent work? What do you want out of like after the show or during until we get to our FMP? What do you want out of Shakespeare and Antigone when we do it in November? What do you want to like learn? What do you want to what skill do you want to gain? 
Um, for me, I'd say a bit more experience with the classical side of acting mm -hmm. because I know I'm more of the musical theatre and yeah. singing through acting. Atheist. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> clearly. I'm um, in the and that is always going to be my strongest point, mm -hmm. but I would like to strengthen my acting through it, which is quite why I'm actually quite looking forward to Rob's lessons because I know he'll help to train us all with our acting and help us strengthen it. Mm -hmm. mm. What about you? Uh, not with um, Antigone or um, Twelfth Night, but similar to like the opposite of what you yeah. said because my experience was, men was mainly acting rather than yeah. musical theatre. So, like, would I say I enjoy the like singing and stuff more than um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Rob's uh, lesson? I would say no, but it's always an experience, and I always yeah, it helps it, 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 open yeah. up your repertoire. So yes, yeah. <laughs> and yeah, uh, with lessons like these, which aren't necessarily going towards your grade, they're going towards like your own personal life. Yeah, your own like, skills. Yeah, it, it 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 makes it like easier to be like, oh yeah, so I can do it. It's my choice. I don't yeah, need to do it. Yeah, experience. Yeah. What about you, Daniel? Well, for me, it's more you know? like I sense that I also do want to sort of understand like more hidden like meaning because I'm the sort of person who likes to theorize a lot of things as like, well, like read between the lines and stuff like that. Yeah, and it's like it's really tricky because I can com I can think completely different from one another. Like, say for instance, it's like if you look at I don't know like a whole different sort of thing of Macbeth. Like, there's one play where it's like you start with night vision. I don't know if you remember that from yesterday we were oh, watching. Yeah. Like, that can give a whole different yeah. form. But because everybody's so different, you always like feel something towards these certain things. And similar to like Rob and everybody else, like, you can feel a certain thing towards like a certain act when you're watching something. Yeah. What's really curious about like these sorts of things is that like when you look deeper into it, it actually like kind of like rings for your head. What, what like what am I feeling right now? Is it like am I scared? Because if, if, if everyone's feeling scared, I must I must be feeling scared too. Yeah. But I'm also overthinking like the possibilities of like what this could be, like yeah. music, meaning. And I feel like it's much more harder to sort of understand in Shakespeare and in Greek. That's why you kind of like tend to think a lot. Of, like, yeah, like, especially because yeah. like there's I get what you mean. It's basically it's hard to understand Shakespeare in Greek because at least with. Shakespeare, because I don't know enough about Greek plays to have a strong opinion on them. But with Shakespeare plays, one thing that multiple people said, and I love about Shakespeare as well, is there's so many interpretations to it. Yeah. That is one really thing I love about Shakespeare. The best like example I think is like I'm gonna say like Hamlet, because you can see Hamlet in two ways. You can see him as like an insane psychopathic king yeah. who has no remorse for anyone. Or you can see him as like a very tragic character. He lost his father. He like like the only and like his best. He died in his best friend's arms. Yeah. And like how, how and that's one yeah. That's just one thing I love about the Shakespeare stuff. Um, if you do you have any more things you wanted to say of that? Well, I mean, comparing it to like let's say for example with my strong comment, like contemporary contemporary is such like an easy thing because there's always like some sort of like like influence mm -hmm. or inspiration like. You tend to look at another actor and be like, oh, wow, they, they probably were thinking like this and they made them think completely different too. But it's much easier to sort of understand because like the meanings behind those things are just like really easy to go through. Like, you know how you watch like, let's say, for example, like an old American film, mm -hmm. let's yeah. say like 90s, for instance, yeah. that's like yeah. the golden era. Like, when I mean, yeah. Like, yeah. Oh, there's like hope. Sort of yeah, it's, yeah, that's very true, yeah. especially with around 20s. It's all like, they're all happy and stuff. They're like yeah. copying and stuff. Like, even if it goes from sad. Happy, yeah, so that's especially. You tend to sort of look at yeah. it and be like, wow, you know, that feels pretty great. I want to be able to retell a story, well, not like within my own eyes and understand it within that sort of sense, mm -hmm. you know, in a more modern sense where everybody understands it. It's yeah. um, so, mm, what was the next question I was going to ask? No, it was going to be, be my thing. I think the question I asked was like, what skill do I want, we want to learn after Shakespeare and Antigone? I, I, I think with the skill I want to learn, because as much as I, I think the skill I do really want to learn is actually being in touch with my character. 
Yeah. Because one thing I've I've said to my, at least my parents, I don't I've never really said this to other people, but like one thing I really really want to learn as an actor is to be able to play a character that is so far removed from who I am as just a guy. Yeah. I want to be able to play like like as I really want to be able to play these like dark, these really interesting, these unique characters that like like tap into a side of you like, that you wouldn't I would, on an like, everyday basis. Like the um like the character like I have, Malvelio, um the yeah. butler on study, his um his um like he he's a bit of a like a raging narcissist from yeah. what I've like researched. And I was like, okay, this is very interesting. So where do I look? What do I research to how do I get into that character? Because no one wants to be that. No one wants to be be a narcissist. Not yeah. this, but like, yeah. how do I as an actor learn to be so character so far removed from myself? That's something I want to learn. I think I did mention that to Rob and Anna at one time. But like, that's one skill I want to learn, even at the end of this, because that's like one of the biggest yeah. things I want to be able to. Because as an actor, we are supposed act, as actors, we are supposed to be different characters. We're not supposed to be ourselves. You can't act yeah. yourself. Yeah. You can't act yourself on stage. And like, so that's what I want to learn, at least from. Um, <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh for God. God. It's good. Um, yeah. It's good. No, I'll Drop see if I can send it. No, okay. well, just continue uh, audios from okay. I'll, tr- I'll probably okay. send my one yeah. to you or something. One thing I also want to like, add on to that is like, mm-hmm. as much as you like think about like, oh, like, what sort of character like, I want to become, I think about, okay, what, like, what was their thought throughout this whole thing? Like, what is their reasoning for even getting to be in that position or thinking the way that they're thinking? Like for me, I tend to think about just understanding the character and sort of retelling that from my own perspective and not yeah. sort of being the character because some people forget that just even Stephen Todd is just like, you've got to sort of understand the character and just yeah. kind of see it within your own image whilst being you to signify that, you know, that's you seeing it within your own image is not necessarily, okay, damn, he's literally the character because then that's just a bit psychotic, you know? Yeah, fair enough. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What, any other questions are just like, because... Um, Mm-hmm. Earlier, I asked about like people, if each one of us, and what we see in other people that we want to take yeah. on for ourselves. Mm-hmm. Um, but I didn't actually get to hear Jaden's side of it, so I wanted um, to ask, what from your last college, if you saw like your fellow classmates in your last college, what would you adapt into your life, uh, college life here? What would you bring over from what you did there or what other people did there? Or from what you've seen people do here, briefly. I think I think it was you that was saying about the Harrison's. When yeah, he's, he's, he's like, starts he's, doing it. He early. just starts doing it. He's yeah. just very consistent yeah. with work. He gets it in on time. Yeah, similar to that. Um, when I was on my other course, um, I would like I would get the work done, but I would tend to like wake up at like three in the morning and then do it because yeah. I couldn't like go back to sleep. And then, like, the world wouldn't really make much sense after that. Mm. Which I'm going to try and make more time throughout, like, I'm going to say our wake hours, like, in the afternoon. Rather oh, than that's then. like, sort out of proper so, schedule. Sort out, like, yeah. sort out of proper schedule, schedule that's rather one, yeah. than yeah. going so whenever I can't, where, whenever yeah. it's at a time when I can't really do anything else. Yeah, because one thing that's, I'll probably say, is something that keeps you up at night is the back of your yeah. brain going, haven't done this, mm-hmm. haven't done this. Yeah, yeah. Like, I think that's, 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 yeah. that's so maybe making that it's schedule, yeah. Yeah. yeah, maybe yeah. making that schedule and getting it done outside of what's supposed to be set for sleep hours yeah. is just setting some time so you can get on with your certain work, yeah. bits of work so your brain doesn't Overload. Want, yeah, yeah. Overthink yeah. about yeah. it yeah. in that's the subconscious now. I'll go, go ahead. ahead. I'll go ahead. There's, there's also another thing with that. It's like, even if you, like with me, it's like, even if I don't look like I think, mm. is that even enough? Yeah. And that's well, also another you problem. Like, no, no, it's, it's also like whether, you know, you have to go get some like clarification from like others to be like, okay, could you check this to see if it's okay? Yeah. Like, I feel like, okay, you know what? If, if the thing is right there, like all the checklist, I'm working through the checklist. Fine, but at the back of my head, I'm like, okay. And in the end of the day, that. on top of it all as well, is if we get the work done earlier, then we can send it in and have the tutors look at it as yeah. well. Yeah, that's, that's, that's something from a professional that, as well. Yeah, that's something I would actually do want more like, because oh, that's 
I think that's also another reason why I want to get my work more consistent is yeah. so I can get like a professional mm -hmm. opinion on it. Because yeah. I do, I generally do want to be told like, okay, Daniel, I, your work's okay, but this this is what you need to improve on. Um, yeah. hit maybe here's like what you could write about, yeah, and just like go on. That. I do need that because yeah. that's one thing I did struggle with. That's actually something I, I actually like didn't do last year when I did my yeah. work. I didn't show it to anyone. I didn't even show it to my mum. My like even yeah. even if the research was okay, it was like the formatting of the research, yeah. and like I that's one thing I didn't do, and I will actually like at least talk to one of like my friends about it. Probably yeah. people in level four about it as well, who I know and speak to. Yeah, that's like, one thing I want to do as well is make sure because one thing that really let me down wasn't just the fact that I left it all to the last minute, which was a big impact mm -hmm. on it all, but it was the fact that then because it was so last minute, I then felt almost. Yeah, I'm losing at the end. Don't mm -hmm. worry, um, but yeah, I felt like I. I felt guilty almost because I had left it so late and then I'd be like good, almost going to someone and giving them so much work all at yeah. once and being like, it's can you look through all of this it's pieces not and them. panicking? It's not fair on them. No. Yeah, and, and I, I don't want to feel the same panic that I felt then. Yeah, so yeah. you're... And let's so, be wary about the time as well, so... Yes, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I think, I think we just need one... I think we just need go. one last question and oh, then we'll be done. Oh, mm -hmm. 21 minutes. Jeez. Yeah, okay, so <laughs> well, it's, it's good. Um, so yeah, for the first week, that's not too bad. Yes, yeah, like yeah. All, round, all round us. So, like, let's five things. Like, how do you think of the week in like short sentences? What do you want to do, achieve by like Shakespeare's self? And like, I don't know, just think, just like finish off on a few yeah. things. I don't know. And what do you want? What do you want at the end of like? This term. What, do you, the, what do you want at the end, end of this term? Yeah. End of this term. Um, and that's leave that. A head start, a good head start on coursework. Mm. That's what I'd say. Mm. Before yeah. it gets the last two, three months, I want to get a good portion of it done. Yeah, yeah that's my target. Yeah. You, Jaden, what do you want at the end of this term? Uh, I, 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 I want. Well, I'm, it's happening anyway. But I, I want to have the experience of doing two different shows at the same time That's which yeah. I was going to be doing over the holidays but because the course got shut down we ended up not doing it <laughs> but we were going to do my FMP and the last show I did um, on nights revolving and I was, I was terrified of that yeah so, I can imagine being terrified for all four of us now especially yeah. if it, even if you're on something you still have to learn stuff yeah, yeah. Can imagine. No, what about you Daniel what do you want at the end of this time well, yeah, what's start, your target yeah your target, target goal well, I guess to sort of test my patience, I guess, because mostly before, I, would, I wouldn't like necessarily be fed up. It's more like I'd sit there and think, 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 and it's like a loading, flipping screen. And I would have the answers right in front of me, and I'm not kind of like not seeing them. I'm not, I'm not just seeing them. Like, I'm, 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 I'm like yeah. looking at the things that are just like, okay, they're little tiny things. Mm. But I could have the bigger things and break them down a little bit. And I'll yeah. do that with other things, but not necessarily with this because it's like, okay, people and stress and social stuff. I would yeah. just have it out of the way. Yeah. Just get it out of the way. What about you, Nathan? What's your targets? At the end of this time. I think a few of my targets is A, be consistent with my bloody coursework. Because, mm. like, just start it, get something up on screen, and, like, yeah. try my best to go off on that. I think another thing I really want is confidence. Because yeah, my confidence, like, as a like as an actor and stuff um my confidence just is like it's growing but i mean from year level two it was nowhere i think you could probably see that because you've seen some of the videos of them yeah. and level three i do think it got be better because of lucas yeah. actually when i play lucas for bear because that's a it's not the biggest role but like his role is very jumpy and stuff yeah and with this one i do think my confidence is going to get better because this is what i want this is, this is my calling really but i do just want that confidence in like everything yeah. i do i want to be able to like that like sing i want to be moments. able to sing with confidence i want to be able to act with confidence i want to be able to fail with confidence yeah. if i crack my voice if i forget a line you i want to be character. i don't break that's especially true yeah. i guess my yeah i guess my two things is consistent with coursework and be able to be confident in everything even if i mess up i want to be able to like just Okay, I messed up, but it's not bad. 
so we're actors. It's world. not the end of the world. Yeah. But yeah, I guess that comes to the end of our vlog. Yeah. Um, I will send you. I think I'll send both. Well, actually, no. You're good. I'll send. <laughs> I'll send you the audio of this. Um, I'll go. Jaden, if you can try and send some an audio to someone, yeah. I don't know. We'll figure it out. 